Hey, listen, if you're not happy where you're working right now as a loan officer, just check out Geneva. These guys are fantastic. You broker, you can bank. They're gonna pay you real quick. They've got great rates, they're cool. But if you are thinking about making a move, do me a favor. Don't steal proprietary crap on the way out the door of your old employer. It's just frowned upon. You understand that, right? Like this banner right over there. <laughs> Telling you right now, I guarantee your rate can't catch a break. Um, <laughs> And we cover that in the, in the show today. Anyways, moving on. Did you see this? According to the CFPB, mortgages are no longer the biggest complaint made to the Bureau. You, my friends, have been usurped by debt collectors. Now, isn't that funny? Think about this for a second. Up until yesterday, the only group that's bitched about more than you <laughs> are debt collectors. Have a nice day. Good point, Brian. Here's a complicated question. How many mortgage complaints made to the CFPB are the direct result of CFPB policy? I mean, it's really a self-perpetuating cycle, isn't it? The more crap the CFPB passes, the more people complain, which makes the CFPB pass more crap. It's endless. <laughs> The Colorado Mortgage Lenders Association is having a little shindig on April 13th. It's gonna be very cool. Frank and I are going to be there. Here's the deal, they still have some room for vendors. This is a great way for you to get your company in front of people who buy the stuff that you're selling. You get it? Check it out, click this banner right over there. Yeah, this is the CMLA's 25th year doing this event. It's quite large, so check it out. Now listen to this. 81-year-old Air Force vet Robert Garcia and his wife Katie just bought their first home using a VA loan. Now, how cool would it be to be that loan officer? That's the best part about this whole business, when you're given the opportunity to share in other people's really great moments. Here's a really cool thing. When you do VA loans, take the time to look at the DD-214's accommodations. Now, I've done loans for vets that were freaking war heroes, man. They never told me, had to find it out on the DD-214. It's a French benefit of being a loan originator. Also, VA mortgages beat all other rates. Check out this graph. And by the way, this is for the 21st straight month. Here's a thought. Market VA home loans. They're great loans. They're pretty forgiving, so they're easy to do. And you get to help vets. Seriously, you don't need a base next to you to do these things. That 81-year-old guy, Robert Garcia, he didn't know he had VA benefits, true story, until he went to a VA housing summit. Seems crazy to me, but I'm in the business, but that's just the darn truth of it. How many other Robert Garcias are out there? We're thinking about. Okay, a couple of days ago, we did a story on the CFPB's monthly payment worksheet, which is either comically or tragically flawed, confusing, unnecessary, misleading, reprehensible, put it this way. If you put this crap out and you had deep enough pockets to make a splash, <laughs> you bet your life you'd have the CFPB on your doorstep trying to find you. I mean, it's really that bad. Don't touch those! Don't you ever touch my balls without asking. Anywho, we mentioned that we thought it would be funny and really informative if you sent this to your elected officials and asked them and their staffers to fill this thing out to see if they can make heads or tails out of it. Newsflash, they won't. See, this is good, man. Because your government officials, when they can't fill this out, and then they give the all caps WTF triple exclamation point, you know, maybe, just maybe, they'll see out of touch these clowns are. And maybe, just maybe, they'll perk the little ears up at the next CFPB hearing and actually ask a question rather than vomiting during their five minute bully pulpit diatribe because that's what they seem to do with these things. It's true, we just watched the last hearing and they never even got around to the questions. It was just blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Anyways, do us a favor. Pretty please, try to fill this thing out so you'll have a point of reference. And then, please forward it along with the appropriate message, which is one scoop candor, two cups outrage, and a sprinkle of levity, and ask them to fill it out. We've been asked by people that are far more important than we are to do this. And that's a true story, by the way. So will you do it? Thank you. And I'll give you the link down below on the post so you can get to that form. We've been feeling the pulse of the industry for the past couple of days. And all we got to say is this. 
Quit piling on guaranteed rate. Now I know we just did a show on this. We did it because it was newsworthy and had a good message to go along with it, which is don't steal stuff that doesn't belong to you. But you know, blaming all of guaranteed rate for the actions of a few, you know, it's just not right. A lot of that stuff seems to be going around these days. Some deserved more so than others, but with these guys, the actions of a few doesn't reflect the beliefs of the whole. Just seems fair. <sighs> you know, I'd like to remind everybody too that MGIC has lowered their rates. So if you're getting PMI on your deals and you want to save your people some money, you should use MGIC by clicking this banner over there because they've lowered their rates, man. Why not give them something better? And probably their best, MG, you know, they're the best MI company in the business. So why not, you know, I mean, come on. And if you go to Hot Shots on Mortgage Shots, there's a picture, the Hot Shots, get it? Hot Shots? On Mortgage Shots. Yeah, of an MGIC account rep. Mm, check it out. That's always worth checking out. All right, you guys have a great one. Forward, share, subscribe, and catch you later here. Leave your comments and adios. I'm not, and I'm not kidding. Seriously, <laughs> check it out. And then post your own hotshot. Male or female, hot is, you know, it's a relative term. <laughs> See ya. Bye. Bye.